Hey, what's poppin' YouTube family? Wait, wait, wait. Cut to the beat. I know oh, you like that. How long you been back, man? Welcome, 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 I see the girls in the club, they're getting wild for me. And all the pretty chicks all wanna smile at me. These rap cats, man, they all got this out for me. And if I ever see them, man, they probably bow to me. And when this beat drop, I know they gon' lean. World debut. I okay, it's time to get into the Queen Gloria groove with Incondicional. Inconditional, I think I said that right, which I believe means unconditional in Portuguese. Let me know in the comments below if I got that right. But I'm definitely anxious to hear how this sounds, especially after Apagalus. When I listen, when I tell y'all I listen to that song every day and the vocal capability that Gloria Groove basically put forth in that amazing like i'm ready to hear something on here like with just just as if not even better vocal capability so let's jump into this okay Oh, that's, oh, is that, is that, is that, is that Ms. Ma oh, is that his mother? Is that her mother? Like, whoa, I like that. Ooh, that red is fire. I'll, I want to pause it real quickly and say that I love how she's incorporating the um, home movie aspect within um this video it gives you a sense uh, it gives her a sense of like transparency and being able to connect with her fans and not even just her fans but just the core audience of being able to allow people to see what's inside her heart and what she holds near and dear to her so it makes her more tangible and it makes her more likable and relatable it, it shows that the mask is off and that she's about to sit here and just bear it all out and I love that about this already. Like, I'm very anxious to hear how this sounds now. I love that red. Okay, Harmony, come on. Woo. Okay, no, 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 no. I was not ready. G Gina Garcia is not about to sit here and just give us vocals like that. I was not ready. You know what? I got to take that back. I was not ready for that. Come on. Take that back. I was not ready for that. Mm. Ooh, that said chills down my spine. How amazing and angelic and her voice was. It was like an angel just started singing. Oh, and I love how vulnerable she is on her lap. Come on with the run, yeah. Come on. 
come on. Come on with the harmonies. Let's go. Okay, I gotta say right now that you knew Gloria was about to tear that up soon as she sat there and turned towards the camera. Like, I love how fearless she is and how she just chooses to attack a track. Like, you know she's about to murder it. And I love the confidence and conviction she has within herself. That she's like, you know what, despite how, I, how society may view um, how I live my lifestyle. I'm gonna be content and comfortable within my skin and in myself and just be authentically me and I love that. You cannot help but to just love that. And I love the dynamic that um, Gloria Groove and um, Gina Garcia, which I'm assuming is um, Gloria's mother, like the dynamic that they have between each other, like you can sense the love, especially the way that Gina was singing, like you can tell like she was singing from the depths of her heart, like it was almost as if, if I could say that she was almost singing as if she was taking it back to when she may have been giving birth, like that, like I feel like that's what she was picturing when she basically was like that's the that's the feeling and raw emotion she tapped into when she decided to say yo i'm gonna sing this song and i'm good and we're gonna we're gonna kill it and annihilate it on this track i love how they are just doing this like you could tell their love is unbreakable it's unconditional it's not binded by no contracts they love each other authentically and genuinely i love that Oh, that falsetto is beautiful. Mesmo quando o tempo acabar, mesmo que não seja agora, ainda assim será. Mesmo quando o céu se apagar e o mundo for meu lugar, mesmo que não seja agora, ainda assim será. That was beautiful. Yeah, this is definitely going on my playlist. This 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 better be on Amazon Music or I will be This better be on Amazon Music. I'm definitely about to put this on my um playlist. I love this track. Oh, sorry y'all. Uh cuz I wind up forgetting putting this on my playlist. Uh, yep, it is there. We added that right there to the playlist. Okay, that was definitely going on my playlist. Okay, so let's quickly talk about um, Gloria Groove 
Incondicional featuring um, Gina um, Garcia, which I said, like, I believe, which is her mother. I love how effortless and how fluid their voices just seamlessly blended together. It was almost as if it was like it was made for each other. It was like peanut butter and jelly. Or when you sit there and think about ice cream going into a bowl with sprinkles on top. Or when you sit there and think about chicken with hot sauce. Or watermelon with seeds or without the seeds. Whatever you want to take, whatever pairing you want to take, that's what I was getting from this. This, <sighs> this duet together was so spectacular and so amazing and so touching and so beautiful. Like, I don't know where to begin to start to sit there and speak about it, but all I can do is say that it was amazing. I love how this was two voices, two presents of human beings on a track. And when you can sit there and have two human beings on a track that could body any choir or course to sit there and overtake them and overshadow them, I think is absolutely phenomenal and absolutely amazing. You have to realize this is two people and they sound like they could be a whole choir. Like there could be like 30 or 40 people actually singing this song. I love the beautiful harmon harmonies. I love the melodies. I love the runs. I love how vulnerable. I love how transparent they were. I love how they just bared their soul and their love for each other. And basically it was like not a binding contract. It was just like tearing it up. Like, you know what? This is my... This is my baby. This is my mama. Regardless of the way that Gloria is living her life or despite how society may want to ostracize her because of how she chooses to live her life, I'm going to be there for her. And that's what I think a lot of us need to do within society. We need to embrace our children and just embrace those differences, especially when we live in a world where when we live in a social media age where things circulate around the internet and it's so easy for people to off themselves because of them feeling like they're misunderstood or they're insignificant and I, and you can tell that the bond that they share that Gloria has never felt insignificant between the relationship that she and her mother has like together their bond is inseparable and unbreakable I just love it and like this to me was like the epitome of almost like Katy Perry's American version of unconditional just by just the just by the the runs the musicality the cadence everything and it being in Portuguese and them singing in Portuguese and then I'm hearing it and I'm like whoa like that is phenomenal like they absolutely killed that like you cannot get any better than what they did on this track like that was in a complete obliteration and annihilation like for English to be my first language and for me to be able to listen to this and to be able to see the beauty and the aesthetic behind it and just just the simple red which you could which some people would think is so which red is sultry and seductive but then red also stands for love and passion and fire and just different things like that and I feel like they embodied all of that on this track like they completely killed this I can't rate this because their performance on this was unmatched I thought that that was phenomenal I'm gonna put this up with Apaga Aluse, Apaga Luz um, which is turn down the lights I believe in Portuguese but I love this I thought that this was so phenomenal I definitely love this and this is why I love the Brazilian culture so much because there are so many facets to it and just learning about it and just and just seeing just the, the differences and just what makes it so unique and so profound and so impactful. I thought that that was amazing. I loved it. I loved it. I loved it. Hands down. That's all I could sit there and say. So let me know in the comments below what you thought of Gloria Groove in Condicional. And with that being said, please remember to be safe out there, especially in the times of this pandemic. Remember to stay awesome, be awesome, because you guys are all awesome. This is your boy Mark, and I'm signing off. Deuces. Peace.